Word Trip Singapore is a brainchild of our two both co-founders, Mr. Ayo Yamasan and Mr. Murosaki san. They have a simple vision of a social traveling platform that will actually unify the whole traveling experience. Connecting the hosts and the travelers in one platform whereby they are able to create itineraries, share itineraries and even talk about the experiences after traveling and this will be paying it forward a concept whereby the, these people who have experienced this, these uh, nice experiences from the host will go back to their home country and be a host themselves and this in Japanese culture is what we call omotenashi it's essentially when you receive something nice from somebody you want to share this experience with another person so that they can have the same experience as you I came on board this project because I believe in the cause of WTS I have an avid traveller myself I have been to 75 countries over the past 3 years and from what I experienced I realised that usually when you go to a country the best, the most beautiful sceneries are not what you see there whereas it's the interaction that you have with the locals or with the friends that you made over there and this is what makes travelling unique and this is exactly what I believe that WTS will be able to transform the travel industry it is essentially and I believe an application that is made for travellers by travellers. The travel industry is a very big industry as you can as you know. Okay, we see this industry in a form of a, a very big horizontal market with a lot of verticals linking it. However, because all these vertical, they are essentially OTAs with centralized system. So the aim of WTS is to connect these dots with all these very highly centralized systems into one decentralized platform whereby we are able to scale all the resources that's available to make the economy, to make the industry much better. World Trip Singapore will focus on four main areas whereby we feel that we are able to improve and, add, and value add to the industry. Number one, we are going to make traveling more affordable. Traveling more affordable, this is like an oxymoron. You never get people telling you that traveling is cheap. And this is exactly what we are going to do. We are going to cut away the middleman, we are going to cut away the commission so that businesses will not have to add on additional fees to their services and consumers will not have to pay additional, additional fees for these services as well. Number two, we are going to make traveling fun again. What do we mean by that? It's exactly the same first point that we had because of the high costs of businesses in the travel industry they will have to usually do itineraries that are you know part of a very big attraction and is popular among tourists and then you, eventually you will see all these right in the mill itineraries that is basically what everybody is just looking at and then travelling becomes like something not so unique anymore and this is where we want to come in by connecting the host directly to the travellers we will be able to let the host share everything that is interesting in their hometown with the travellers and this will make cities that are usually not so popular with tourists more interesting for them to explore for example in Singapore most people who come to Singapore they will usually say what I'm going to the Marina Bay Sands I'm going to Sentosa but how many of these travellers actually know about the last kampong for example in Buangkok or even a one day hike trip in Pulau Ubin so all these things will make travelling fun again because every single travelling trip you make will be a unique one, will be a personalised one that only you will be able to experience. And we are going to make travelling easier. What does easier mean? Essentially, we, with a common currency in place on our platform, the travellers will be able to use it for services, for example, transportation, dining, accommodation. And they don't, without having the need to do a currency exchange in the city that they visit and this will save a lot of costs for the travellers as well and lastly, we are going to make travelling safe for everyone again right now, with the data overload that you have in the internet when you search for a certain attraction for example you cannot, you are not able to actually differentiate between what are the fake reviews what are the genuine reviews or what are the paid advertisements so eventually, with this information overload we tend to not be able to differentiate the correct experience, the good experience that you want with the ones that is paid by an advertisement to put up on the 
platform that is restricted by the OTAs. And with this, we will eliminate a lot of safety issues that we will have when we are traveling. There will be three aspects of the platform that we'll be aggressively looking at to maintain the market interest of our project. Number one, we are going to scale up our payment options. And this can be done through aggressively approaching strategic stakeholders in the industry itself to provide us and uh, provide our consumers accommodation, transportation, dining, and uh, even travel tour agencies. And secondly, we'll be working very closely with the industry leading cryptocurrency POS system providers so that we want to ensure that our cryptocurrency is widely accepted around the globe without any restrictions. And to make it more interesting for all the users of our platform, we will be, going, we will be looking at gamifying the whole traveling experience. For example, we will be doing a lot of in-app challenges where the users can take part and then they can earn rewards along the way. And also, we will be working closely with all our merchants and all our partnership so that users, when they, for example, when they check in in a different restaurants or a different attraction, they will be able to earn exclusive contents, for example, or rewards that they can use at the merchant itself. We chose the blockchain technology, especially the Ethereum protocol, to be the main backbone of our system, of, our, of this particular project, because we believe that with this technology, we will be able to eliminate most of the pitfalls that I have mentioned earlier regarding the travel industry. Firstly, we believe that the blockchain smart contract technology will help us to eliminate high costs of commission and fees that is being bared by the customers at this point of time. And this is because of all the very highly centralized system of the different OTAs, whereby businesses pay a lot of money and commission to the OTAs to provide such services. And by eliminating this middleman, we can pass all these savings to the consumers directly. And secondly, with, with the decentralized nature of blockchain technology and the AI in our platform, we will be able to ensure that all the reviews that is being given by the users of this platform to be transparent. Facts or reviews are being manipulated by a third party source whereby they hide only the, 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 you know, the bad reviews and only provide the good ones. As a system of a blockchain, we ensure that everything is transparent and that we have all the data as per what the users provide. So previously, we talked about gamifying the whole traveling experience in our platform. So with the Ethereum protocol in the blockchain technology, we will be able to incentivize all our users with crypto rewards that they can basically earn when they do things like having in-app challenges inside our platform or doing revenue generating actions, for example, like giving a review for a merchant they have just visited. And all this will be a way for them to get rewards that are basically borderless in nature. And there's no restriction on where they can use this reward. First and foremost, I believe and I feel that all these data that we collected from our platform should first and foremost benefit all the users, all the participants of our ecosystem. So for instance, for the users, the travelers that uses our platform, using these data that we collect, they will be able to discover more hidden gems, more different itineraries that are not being offered by mainstream tour, tour agencies, and they will be able to get to know more of the options that they can, they will, they can have when they, visit a, when they visit a city or a country. And of course, for our merchants and partners that are on board with us in the platform, they will be able to utilize all this data that we collected to understand better the traveling experiences or the traveling habits of the consumers so that they will be able to create more personalized and targeted itineraries or experiences for them. At this moment, our web developers, they are hard at work trying to get the beta version of our web application up by the first quarter of 2019. And also, we are working very hard in connecting with various strategic stakeholders inside and outside of the industry to provide more value-added options for our customers and our users of the, of the system. We are not going to just restrict our services to planning and executing of itineraries. We want our customers and our users to be able to use many services inside and outside of the industry while they are using our ecosystem. What we want the users to achieve is to be able to utilize 
all different needs for their traveling in one platform. For example, we want them to be able to make a reservation for, for a dinner or even an accommodation for a hotel stay in the city or for example, a transportation need they need to get from one place to another in the platform itself. And so this is going to be achieved by engaging with more stakeholders in the industry and outside of the industry to ensure that we get a lot more services in place for the users to engage in. And today we are very happy to announce that over the past one month, we have tied down two strategic partnerships in our platform. Number one, we have Best Buy World on board. They are the biggest premium outlet shopping e-commerce website in Southeast Asia. And number two, we have Air Locker from Japan, which will cater for all your luggages and storage needs. So what is in it for you to join our ICO at this early stage? The very good news is that we are having a private sale right now. So instead of paying one US dollars for one token, we are giving you the token at a very good rate now, which is one token at 0.25 cent US dollars. And on top of that, we are giving you 40% additional. So once the system is being implemented, you will be able to use our World Trip Experience token to access all the various services that is available on our platform. For example, you can use it to pay for transportation, use it to pay for accommodation like I mentioned earlier, dining experiences, or even paying using the token to pay the host for the services rendered to you. So it's a very simple equation. If you adopt our token at the early stage, you will be able to enjoy more value when our token is launched at one US dollars is equal to one WTX token. Thank you for your time today. I hope that you have understand more of our project. We are all very excited about the prospect of how this is going to be a game changer in the travel industry. And we are looking forward to bridge culture one experience at a time. Thank you so much.